RGB LEDs are deodors from IKEA. They're about forty dollars for the set, but uh, I'm just borrowing them from a friend. Uh, I'll probably use something else later on for the actual uh, output because at ten dollars for each one of these, it's kind of expensive. So they're hooked up to this breadboard, which is the same breadboard from my Arduino, but I'm not using the Arduino in this. I'm just using the breadboard to hook them all up to the one output on the color organ. And so we've got ranges for high, mid, and low, and then potentiometers for each to adjust the color levels. Um, the schematic is exactly the same as the one that Colin posted on the Make Magazine YouTube channel, so I'll put a link to that. Uh, for power, we're just hooked up to an ATX breakout board. This is the one from SparkFun, which is hooked up to an old ATX power supply. For the audio input, I just kind of hooked up this headphone jack, and it goes into the screw terminals here. Uh, once I once I decide to print out an actual circuit board, I'll probably make it a lot nicer looking. I mean, because obviously this is, you know, not the nicest looking thing in the world, but it works. Thanks for watching.